What's up you guys? It's Michelle here. Thanks for joining me today and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing my classic spread for Valentine's week, so stay tuned for a fun plan with me. Going to be using the Planty Things Spring Vibes and the Fun Alphabet for this spread. I want to use some of these large fun letters to spell out like XOXO, but I'm super excited to use these. Even though there aren't any Valentine's Day sticker stickers in here since it's for spring, I just love a challenge and I feel like I can pull it together. And you can always use code MICHELLE10 to save 10% off on your Planty Thing orders, and I always appreciate your support. So I saw these little flower shops and I thought that would be like a good starting point. I want one with a lot of pink, so I'm probably gonna go with this one. And this one has a lot of pink. I probably wanna use three of these. So I think this one would be good over here. And I want this one here. I'm not sure about the where I'm gonna put the third one, but I do wanna use that one. And I may end up using some of these from Favorite Florals too, just in like the pink shades. Like this would be good. I would only use the part with the pinks though. So I'm gonna use that there to cover up that white out. scoot that over a little bit because I think I want to do a larger quote here. In the sidebar, I want to spell out XOXO in these letters. Okay, I'm going to sort of center it, but I'm going to let this curly part of the X go over into the next section. Oh, that looks so cute. All right, so now I want to spell out all you need is love and flowers. I made on the Cricut the all you need is and flowers, but I'm gonna spell out love in these letters. Right here next to this. Okay, so I'm gonna put this above that. And this below it. And that really pulls together our flower shop theme. Oh, that's cute. And then back in spring vibes in this other section, I'm gonna use this little mailbox or birdhouse. to put right beside the flower shop and trim it down a little bit. Oh, that looks so cute and it's got a little heart. So I'm gonna put this full pink box right up here. 
Or I could mix some of this from Favorite Florals, this darker pink, because that still goes. I think that's what I'll do. I think I'll use the brighter pink box over here. I'm going to put it more in the middle. Okay, and then we'll do the lighter pink right here. Let me scoot this up just a little bit. And then we could do this brighter pink along with the, another of the lighter one. Okay, perfect. I like all the different pinks. And then over here, let's do Do this one here. With that one layered off of it. One more of this medium pink in the slender box. And the lighter pink below it. And I'm going to trim those off with or even with that line. Okay, and I think we need one more over here and we'll be done with boxes. And I'd like the one of the brighter, like this color. I don't think I have one, but I can cut this one down. Kind of like it's sliding out. Okay, perfect. All right, now I want to create like some little hanging flower pots. I think I'm going to use this lighter pink circle and cut it in half. And Do one here, and then I'll just put some little flowers spilling out of it and draw the lines for the hangers. We're gonna try that and see. So I've gotta find flowers to put in it for. Okay, some of these little greenery branches will be good to hold on to. some of those pink flowers. Okay, something like this is perfect. So I'm gonna cut that one apart. Maybe I just have room for one here and I'll do another one over on the other side because I want it to be a little longer. Okay, that actually looks perfect just like that. I don't really need to put anything else with that one. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and draw some lines and see how what we think about that. And then I'll do a couple more of these elsewhere in the spread. And I'm just gonna use a thin, a fine point ballpoint pen. This is a 0.7 millimeter and it. it's a zebra pen.
Okay, let's do another one right down here. Trim that little greenery scrap to get us started. And I'm gonna stick with those same flowers that we were using, these. Okay, we could do that, and I need a little bit of greenery on the other side. I'm gonna add this little piece to that one. Get a little bit more height there, and then we'll do this on the other side. Okay, so cute. Okay, and then I think we'll do one more over here. This pink. All right, let's start out with this. Since this one's a little bit, I don't think it's quite as low down as that one is. I know we'll do one of these to give it some height. I'm gonna go ahead and draw the lines before I add that one. All right, let's go ahead and draw some lines and bullet points and then we'll do our black words and finishing touches. And let's add a few here. up here okay and here And a few over here. How about if we spell yay instead of sweet because it's just uh, shorter? All right. Then we'll have three fun little quotes. Okay, now we want you need some bullet points up here and here. And I'd like to do the darkest or the brightest pink just to kind of pull it together. That was in here.
think we need three. Okay, and then three over here. Okay, perfect. I just want to do a few flags in the bright pink. Oh, and we do need a Valentine's Day sticker. And I made one on the Cricut with that same font as this. So let's do that up here. And that's cute. That's kind of like a quote. Okay. And our words. I'm almost out of today. I need to make some more of these. And... I think this is kind of tight anyway. I'm not going to put anything there. And I have a live patron plan with me here, but I can always just write that in. Okay, and up here, let's do something like important. Or let's do shopping, because I do need a place to write down little things I remember that I need to buy and to do and then something else up here. I'll do this, write it down. Oh, I love it. And since this is a larger piece, let's put this right over here. Put that there. this here and put this little scrap up here Let's put this larger flower right here. Got a pretty scrap right here with a lot of pink in it. this here okay let's add this to this larger flower I'm not gonna do a full border on the top and the bottom I'm just gonna drop a few off here and there okay just a little bit of pink flower action here
put a flower there. And a little bit more over here. And a tiny bit right here. All right, and that's gonna be my Valentine's week spread. I love the little flower shops and all the flowers, and these letters are so much fun. Thank you guys for hanging out with me while I put it together. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, and I can't wait to see you in the next video. Bye.